Hi everyone, uh, Gabriel here. We are going to Batam today to fish the Balang Pond. It's a Goover Pond. Uh, we are going to try out the new Storm 360 GT Coastal series of soft plastics as well as the new VMC jig heads. So we hope to catch some good fishes. Uh, look forward to an exciting day. I'm going to use the, the shrimp first on the 14 gram jig head. So what we were doing is, we were working the edges, so the fish tend to hold along the sides. So as you work the edges, and the curious ones will come out to bite. That's exactly what this hookup is all about. Decent sized fish is probably the average size that you get here. Oh, it's going well. Oh, it's okay. Yeah. Perfect hookup. Yeah. The shrimp is doing well. I already had two hookups. So let's change to the Lago Shark. Okay, now let's give the weedless hook a try uh, with the Lago Shad. the drop. Okay, it's going to the...
Yes. Nice. Thank you, boss. Okay, it's a good hookup. Okay, we try again. For the weedless jigget, uh, because it's not really weighted, um, you gotta let it actually sink. It takes some time to sink. So, in that case, uh, it's a very slow retrieve, very slow uh, presentation. So, more patient one with this retrieve. And it takes time for you to actually feel, feel the jig head with the soft plastic moving. So unlike the, the other two, uh, the, the Coastal X, the Jig X, uh, which is weighted, um, it sinks straight down. So, and because it's also weighted 7, 10, 14 grams, you can actually feel it, feel it much easily than, than the weightless Jig Head. So then the weightless Jig Head, because uh, again, with no weight, it tends to take flutter down, it takes some time to, to drop down. So you've got to you know, let it drop and you've got to feel it in that sense. It's a more subtle presentation, more finesse presentation, but when the fish are finicky, it does get you the bite. So if you're fishing different types of terrains, it's, uh, it's important to, to choose the jig heads wisely. Um, you know, if you're, if you're looking for deep waters, of course the heavier jig heads will apply better. Mm, in this case, it's shallow, we are not really targeting such deeper waters. The, the weedless jig head works fine because you know, it gives some time for it to drop with the water column being so small or so short. So you can choose how you want to present your soft plastic. With, with the, the weedless, it's a very slow fall. Unlike your common jig, your normal jig head, where it really just drops. So you can see that it's a very slow fall. You know, in a way, it just glides down. So it's a more finesse presentation. So uh, it's good for snaggy areas. So I think the pond, there's different structures here. So if you're actually fishing close to structure, a long structure, the weedless does help you to avoid the snacks. So it's it's good. Perfect look up. Thank you. Look up on the side. Oh, you see the big one. <laughs> yes, thank you, boss.
it's a it's a very patient game. To hop the soft plastic back. But it's well worth it. Can you hook up like that? Thank you. Okay, so we just ended fishing today. We it was a good day. We had multiple hits on soft plastics, so we were trying out the new Storm Coastal series of soft plastics as well as the new VMC jig heads. So uh, do give it a try, and I'll see you very soon.